What's up guys, we're back at it playing some more Ghost Recon 2001, the original version. Now in case you're not familiar, in the previous mission I was having some audio issues at the end of it and Ramirez died. But when we replayed the mission, Ramirez survived, so that means he carries over into this one. We're going to keep with the current timeline that I showed you guys. Ramirez, he's good to go. So let's get to it. We're on mission number six, Witchfire. It's official. President Arbatov just appeared welcoming the Republic of Georgia into the new Russian Democratic Union. Of course, no one's recognizing the annexation. The Georgian government in exile issued a strong denial from their offices in Geneva. And the US, Great Britain, and Germany have all publicly condemned the Russian invasion. But all the talk in the world isn't going to budge those tanks in Tbilisi. The big boys are convinced that Arbatov and his generals are engineering another intervention. Satellites have detected major troop movements on the Baltic coast near the Latvian border. Latvia, Lithuania, and Estonia were all part of the old Soviet empire and bringing them back under Moscow's control has been part of the ultra-nationalist agenda for years. We're sending you in to gather intelligence about the coming attack. The Russians have set up a command post at Izborsk, an old medieval fortress a few miles from the border. Your mission is to infiltrate the post and recover any documents describing the Russian battle plans. Watch out for patrols. There's been a lot of troop movement along the road. There's also a comm station inside the castle. Don't let the garrison radio for help or you'll have a major firefight on your hands. One final twist. There's a mobile SAM site nearby. Reconnoiter, and if it's lightly guarded, take it out with rockets. All right, we got a night mission. Looks like we have some reconnaissance to do. We got to gather intel from the southeast house, gather intel from the northwest house, get to the extraction zone, and destroy the SAM site. In the squad, we got Yip, Bachman, and Jacobs. They're on Alpha. They've been doing pretty good. Ghosts have got a couple couple dubs under their belt. Morale, morale's pretty high, so we're going to keep it like it is. Russell Ramirez on Bravo. They've been doing all right. Once again, Ramirez, he's back in the mix. He's back in the action. We got Russell. He's got the rocket launcher. That's going to come in handy. And on Charlie, we got Stone, the new guy. Let's see what he can do. Welcome to Russia, comrade. Everybody get your passports ready. All right, now in this mission, if you played it before and you're not new, you're not new to the channel, and if you are, like and subscribe. Hit me up in the comments below. Let me know what you think. But if you're not new, I'm not going to spoil anything, but you got to watch this road. If you don't watch this road, you're in, for, you're in for a rough time. And in case you're not aware, the game we're playing is Ghost Recon. It's a tactical shooter from 2001. It's very old, but I find it's quite fun. I'm going to show you guys why. All right, let's get Jack Stone. He's our sniper. All right, so other than the data graphics, you know, you got to you got to give credit where it's due. This game has amazing atmosphere. Let's just be honest. All right, so it looks like a patrol's moving away. One guy here, let's take him out. Scratch another one. Alright, let's switch to Mr. Russell. You're gonna need that rocket launcher, my friends. See if we can hit the SAM site all the way from back here. Look at that. Whoa! Someone my audio is going crazy. They're shooting grenades. They're going crazy. <laughs> Never seen that before, but it's pretty funny. Oh, we're just going to leave Bravo here. They're going to keep watch. Alpha. Alpha's just going to have to be a little bit proactive here. Make sure they don't sneak up on us. Okay, Bravo's taking... Does Bravo see anyone? Gotta check the map. Nope. Just one guy pushing up. Alright, so we got the SAM site. Now we can... We're free to just... Mosey on up here. Okay, that's what I was, that's what I was saying. You gotta watch the road. We got a truck. Let's see if we can ambush them. He's 
victory. Kill confirmed. It's pretty cool when you hit the tires, the truck deflates, like the tire deflates and the truck goes down. Honestly, you don't see that in some games nowadays. It's kind of sad. But this game, they got it right. This game, this game has a couple things going for it. Got one last guy here. Check this out. Alright, looks like we got targets left. Surprised they didn't hear that, but not complaining. Let's keep pushing up here. Where are you going? Alright, this, this level is a little buggy today, but pretty funny. That's this game in general. It's not exactly the most... The audio is crazy. I think we're going to move into a sprint here, see if we can get around this house. Don't really want to linger in the road. Okay, there we go. Bit of action there. Alright, we got the intel. Let's get out of here. Bull moon. Just like that. There's another two guys here, yep. We're going to switch back to Charlie. Look at that, they even programmed a lean animation. That's pretty cool. Alright, so I think the plan here... Goodbye. Alpha seems to have that flank secure, so now we're going to send Bravo, the specialist, into the castle. We're actually going to take control of Ramirez. He was pretty good last time, so... Maybe you can keep that momentum, keep that same energy. Goodbye. <laughs> Gotta love it. Alright, I think this is the house. Let's check the map, just to be sure. Yeah, looks like the intel's somewhere around here. Now, the thing is, in this game, you don't want to sprint. That makes a lot of noise. The enemies will know where you are, so... 
It's got to creep around. They'll still know where you are, but not as easily. Clear to me. A couple enemies still close by here. Kill confirmed. All right, we're good. We got the intel. Now we're gonna get Bravo to hightail it out of here. I don't think we want to stick around here any longer. Orders received. Yes, sir. Orders received. I think we send everyone into the field over here. Take control of Alpha. Charlie can scout the way here. Charlie's actually way behind, so we're going to get Charlie with us. We're gone. Uh, nope, don't want to go through there. On our way. Perfect. Nice and simple. Alright, let's take control of Alpha. Once again, Alpha, they kind of just have point all the time. You want to keep them pushing forward. Because when Alpha, when they clear them out, then you can send in the the specialist. And then obviously the sniper, he, he plays more of a backseat role. Just use him to pick off targets at long range. We've arrived. Whoa. Let's see if we can get him with the grenade launcher. This thing's pretty fun. Kill confirmed. <laughs> Kill confirmed. Now, fun fact, the OICW, this experimental weapon, that I think they used in like 2000, I can't remember the year they tried this, but anyways, to get to the point, the grenade launcher on this weapon, it was supposed to, you could set it to like a range and it would explode behind doors and walls, sort of provide indirect fire, whereas normally a grenade has to hit a hard surface. And obviously, the, at the time, this was too hard to program into this game, so they just made it a rapid-fire grenade launcher. <laughs> and it's as broken as it sounds. In position. Bit of a random tip there, but... Alright, let's send Bravo up. Moving out. I think at this point, everyone can just run to the extraction point. Seems like it's... Seems like it's pretty clear. Those guys didn't stand a chance. There's the boat. We got Bachman, we got we got Yip. The boys are here. Still waiting on Charlie. Let's take control of Bravo. Double time it. They're taking their time. They're taking the scenic route. Charlie's there. Now he's got to pull through with Bravo and then it's all done. Mission complete. Boom, there we go. You've gathered all the intel. And just like that, we have another successful op. Everyone's healthy. We got Jacobs with 21 kills. This man's a Terminator. So once again, everyone gets a point for the next mission. Everyone's going to get upgraded. Everyone's healthy. Check it out next time. Make sure to like and subscribe if you like what you see. And let me know what you think in the comments below. 
I'm going to be doing this series possibly every week. I'm going to try and get a little more consistent with the uploads, but until next time. <laughs>